Hi there, Taurus. Welcome back to Star Lordis Tarot. I'm going to be doing your weekly read from August the 27th through to September 2nd. I went ahead, shuffled the cards, laid them out, and let's get started interpreting your reading, Taurus. Okay, first off, you have for your overall energy Five of Wands, and followed by the Seven of Wands in the upright. And next we have the Two of Wands in the upright, followed by the Five of Cups in the reverse position. And lastly, we have the Seven of Cups in the upright position. Okay, now, for your overall energy, you have the Five of Wands in the upright position. This card mainly speaks of um, petty squabbles, quarrels, uh, sometimes competition. Um, this is the he said, he, sh he said, she said nonsense where um, people are sometimes trying to drag you into um, uh, conflict or uh, just drama. It's not my favorite card in the deck, <laughs> as you all know, um, just because it's uh, it's kind of like petty little drama that we really are better off sidestepping so for you guys it's showing up of your uh, as your overall energy it could be that somebody could be cut playing out in a work uh, situation or uh, family or friends situation in any realm of your life maybe people are just trying to drag you into some nonsense and as I always advise when this card comes up to just try to sidestep it because uh, Ain't nobody got time for that crap, okay? <laughs> Let's move on. Um, we have the next card of the Seven of Wands in the upright position. Now, this is coming right into the week with this energy. And the Seven of Wands is that of somebody on the defense. Again, it can speak of competition. So for some of you, maybe on some in some realm of your life, you are dealing with some stiff competition. It could be um, at work. Again, it can be in any area of your life. This is just a general read after all. So um, this could be playing out. Uh, it does make sense, I suppose, with the Five of Wands being in the over as the overall energy. It does make sense that uh, for some of you people, if they're trying to drag you into uh, drama and so forth, maybe you are just uh, defending yourself, or uh, if somebody's trying to, uh, you know, convince you of something and you're not wanting to go along with it, you're just sort of standing your ground. Seven of Wands is definitely somebody, someone who's standing their ground against, like I said, competition, against uh, tough situations. Um, it's a strong card, but it's a, a card of feeling like we need to defend ourselves or, um, you know, protect ourselves from uh, things that are going on around us. So you come into the week with that um, right off the hop. Now, moving into the energies of the Two of Wands in the upright position, this mainly speaks of somebody who is sort of making a plan, a plan of action, making a new plan. But it's just in the beginning stages where we're just uh, calculating a plan in our head and sometimes we're working with another even to uh, plan our way forward. So this is a card of forward thinking and forward planning, but we haven't actually taken action yet. We're just um, we're just devising the plan, like I said, either through communication or with another, or um, or just in our own thoughts. We're we're planning something. So moving towards uh, the weekend, the energies of the weekend, the beginning of September, you have uh, the five of cups in the reverse position. Now. I always prefer to see this card in the reverse position because in the upright position, this is a card of somebody who has some emotional fulfillment, but they're dwelling too much on what they have lost. There may have been some type of emotional disappointment, um, and sometimes we can wallow in the emotional di disappointment. We're too busy focusing in on what we've lost and, and not what we still have left over. So uh, this is, you know, a bit of a pity party. But when it's in the reverse position, we're coming out of the pity party. We have accepted the losses and the disappointment, and we are moving on. Um, we're getting away from this, uh, this disappointment feeling and uh, the hurt feeling and the sadness, and we're moving on. Now, moving towards the weekend, the next card you have is the, um, the Seven of Cups in the upright position. 
it's nice to see, especially following the Five of Cups in the reverse, because um, when we let go of those kinds of energies, the emotional disappointment and so forth, um, it does, it, it can, the universe can open up off opportunities for us for more emotional fulfillment. Now, the Seven of Cups can often uh, represent just that. There are plenty more opportunities. Um, you finally uh, stop worrying about this uh, emotional loss, and you're seeing that there's a whole bunch of new opportunities in front of you. And and focusing more in on that so the only uh, word of caution with this card is the seven of cups in the upright can often uh, speak of confusion because sometimes there's just so many options and so many other opportunities that um, we can't see our way clear it can cause a bit of confusion and also too you need to take a very close look at the options and opportunities in front of you because some of them are not really even viable at all we um we just may think this card can often represent sand castles in the air where we imagine we have all these uh these different opportunities but in reality only one or two of them may be really really good viable uh things so we have to take a closer look when it comes to the seven of cups in the upright position so Overall, it's it's not too bad of a reading, Taurus. It looks like a little bit of tough energy concerning some type of competition, and uh, but it looks like you're moving on. You're making a new plan. You're getting over whatever it is that disappointed you, and you're seeing all the brand new opportunities in front of you. So this is pretty wonderful to see for you guys, and I hope this reading helped you. And if it did, please feel free to like, share, and subscribe. Until next time, Taurus, you guys have a wonderful week. Bye for now.